Hey, it's Wrestling Hero Figs. Curb Stomp, beautiful divas. It's got to be some good stuff today, right? I mean, look at this. Just So it's kind of like a little hint of what we're going to get in here. But yeah, Curb Stomp, let me just hold on for one sec. This one right here, this I got from uh, eBay. And it's a must, you know, it's a must to make sure that we have the the right people for it, you know, the right people, managers being Alexa Blisses. Alexa, yeah, just, she needs a manager, and who better else than Mickey James? This is a really old figure. Well, an old Mattel figure. I don't know if you can call Mattel figure old figure, but, yeah, it's, gosh, dating back to early 2000s, and, you know, in order to complete Alexa, you got to have Mickey James, you know, the manager. And speaking of completing, right, I got these belts done, I did the custom uh, women's uh, SmackDown belt and hold on, let's put it on here just to see what it looks like because I used one of those, um, well I think this one, this is the one that came with Seth Rollins, that true exclusive, so I just did a repaint on that and I prefer those ones for the women just because they're you know a little bit on the smaller side. So, it won't get on there quite right, but you get the idea. So, yeah, we got the SmackDown one, and I also did the Raw one. And this one, I think this is just one that came with, um, what was it? Like, you know how you get those chase belts on those basics? So, yeah, I just, I prefer these ones, you know, for the for the women, just because the overall proportions on it, just it suits them better. And speaking of... uh. Charlotte, you know, you can't, again, you can't have Charlotte without Dana Brooke. So, yeah, I picked up this Dana Brooke. Well, actually, I just picked up these two recently, and I will say that, yeah, they did a really good job on the head scan on, on Dana. Like, the lips are, you know, nice and full, just how he has it. I mean, the hair, it's got to be updated. We got to do a repaint, you know, fix up on that blonde, but... These diva figures, yeah, they're definitely improving them. Now, Alexa, I don't know how I feel about the head scan on that, like... I just, I, I don't know. I think they could have gone with a different facial expression. But, yeah, so speaking of Divas, the NXT. And I know you guys saw this one on the unboxing, but I wanted to take a closer look at this one just because of this. This this is a really amazing figure. This is hands down one of the best figures that I've seen in a long time. You know, the de as far as, like, detail and just attention to everything, like, so much designs, paints, like they even redid a whole new foot on this. Because if you look at it, it's got the open toe on that. So, yeah, yeah, I'm really liking this figure. And the mask, they even added the mask. The only thing that they missed, you know, with this figure was that entrance rope that it comes with. I, I guess I had to be gotten in like in a Defining Moments figure. I can see them including that. But this mask is, is really cool. And it sits on there. You know, I know a lot of the masks that they make, you kind of have to mess around with them. But no, it like, it's got the inserts for it and the head scan. Yeah, that's, I'm telling you, they are just doing a better job on these diva figures. They just really stepping up their game, you know. It's, I know a lot of people have complained, like, there's, they don't even look like the diva figures. Why? What's going on, Mattel? But, yeah, no, I, I do like all these. Wow. So, curb stop. Yeah. Anybody that's been on my channel for a while knows that curb stop. Yeah. So, I, 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 I guess curb stop doesn't need an introduction, right? And one thing I wanted to mention about him, um, so he's been mainly running the, the show on Customs One on One, One Hundred One. Go go check go check out our Facebook page because he's been doing so much on that. You know, he's really improved. I've been following the page for a couple years, and he has really improved. That he's been doing videos recently. I know a lot of you have been asking, like, hey, how do you do this? How do you do that? So, yeah, go check out our page. You know, he's been uploading just, yeah, really cool. So, got uh, so many things from him. So, we got uh, another head. Uh, I, I sent over uh, another Vampiro head. So, you know, one of my friends had requested for Vampiro. So, yeah, we got another Vampiro head. And I do like the old head scan on Buff Bagwell. So, he dremeled that out. So I'm excited to see what it, you know what this is going to look like on there, but yeah, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And now, apart from this, we do have a. Oh, hold on! I, I see something glorious. Glorious. Well, it's not his glorious attire. It is beer money. Uh, Bobby Roode. So I got Bobby Roode and James Storm's decals to complete those. It, I don't know if you, you remember. I think it was probably a little while back ago that uh, I had shown like. Uh, you know the figures, but they were in the they're in the works, and this is 
definitely going to complete it. So, really excited. Really excited what they're doing with him with WWE. Yeah, he's in NXT. I, I still do think that he belongs on the main roster. But, yeah, I'm just, I'm really liking the push. I'm really liking how you package these figures. You just, you, you go all out. You, you, you make it feel like Christmas. I'm telling you, Curb Stop. Just everything you've done, really appreciate it. So, yeah, if you were wondering what Tomko was doing back there, I did get the decals on it. So, this, I saw him post this on his Instagram page. And I was like, I gotta get my hands on this. Look at that detail. So, once I get this put together, you know, do the head swab, get the, you know, the rest of the parts on there. I'll, yeah, we'll do a full river, uh, full review on Tyson. I don't know if it'll stay. And we'll try it. So, this last one right here. Oh, it's unfortunate that, you know, he's no longer. Oh, I'm sure he'll come back. You know, they, he'll, they always come back. So, we got Bully Ray. This is uh, Bubba Ray's TNA attire. And this is really cool. So, yeah, he did the decal on the on the shirt. I still got to finish a couple of things. I got to do the wrist uh, the wrist tape on that. But, yeah, this, this attire is so, so cool. So, it's not just on the front, but it's also on the back and on the shorts. So, quick formula uh, on this. This is uh, Kevin Owens, right? So, we got Kevin Owens, the... Low from the lake from the knees down, John Cena, and of course the head scan that came off the I think it was a basic. I don't think I don't think I used my elite for this, but yeah, the arms and head scan came off that that basic from that battle pack that came with Devon Dudley. So overall, really good haul. Really just happy with what Mattel's been doing lately with the Divas. But yeah, till next time everybody.